Hi, I'm Ursula Tipsy Totes, and today I am going to demo the Shoot for the Stars bleach part. So, we have protected our area. We've made sure our pets are on the other side because we are working with bleach. And I have decided that I'm going to wear an apron, so it's, it's like super windy out today, so I don't really want it to blow back on me. We're trying to be conscious of that. It is best to do it in the sun so that it can heat up the bleach and have better effect. So, after you have everything all covered and it's safe, um, make sure you supervise your children with the bleach. And then you just take your little thing and you mist where you want your stars. It's a fine mist is going to be like a faraway galaxy. Um, if you want little drops like this, they're going to show brighter. Um, if you don't want it to <laughs> if you don't want it to cut through, you should put some plastic also in between the two layers so that it doesn't seep through to the back. Because then you can flip it over and do the back the same if you want. If you have somebody that's really artistic, you can take a Q-tip or an old paintbrush and you can actually paint the galaxies or the constellations that you want. So there's a ton of things that you can do. And then you just wait for the bleach to cure and your stars to show up. All right, so we have done the bleach and it's fairly dry. You can see that it's, I got a galaxy over here. So next you would just flip it over and do the same thing on the back. And when you're happy with that result, you stick it in the wash and just wash it according to the directions. And I dried mine and you're ready to wear it.